The book of Daniel was written by the prophet Daniel between 540 and 530 BC. Daniel was among the first group of Israelites taken into captivity by Babylon after the siege of Jerusalem. The book follows Daniel and his fellow refugees as they strive to remain obedient to God in a foreign land. Daniel and his friends prove to be wise, capable leaders and are elevated to positions of influence by the king. A series of cryptic dreams come to the king in his sleep, and Daniel, being near to the throne, interprets them with God-given understanding. These dreams depict Babylon and the numerous world empires to follow, humbled under God's forthcoming kingdom. Following is a short story of Daniel's friends as they face orders to worship a false god. They refuse and are thrown into a furnace, but God miraculously protects them from the flames, displaying his power before the king. Through God's power and Daniel's faithfulness, the king's heart is gradually changed. After initially resisting the meaning of his dreams and visions, Nebuchadnezzar humbles himself, acknowledging Yahweh as the one true God. At the end of the book, Daniel has a dream of his own, depicting four great beasts set against God's throne. A figure described as the Son of Man defeats them and is given authority by God to rule over a kingdom made of all nations and peoples. The book of Daniel draws out the tension between Israel's current opposition and the hint of God's forthcoming hope. Out of this hope, future generations can find the motivation to continue in Daniel's faithful example as they await God's kingdom. Mm -hmm.